Bring, bring. Larry Tuttle. Hello, 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 hello. What's up, man? Give me a second here, trying to get everything up and working. What's up, dude? They have a uh, band Zion from Facebook for a day or two. He usually gets a few a week. Uh, they made me send pictures in. We get him back, you know. Oh well. Yeah, just trying to get all the chats up and stuff right now, so bear with me. There it is. There it is. What's up, man? We do. Right now, we're not really that close on... Uh, never mind. Chad bought some. So, we're getting close on the top scroll. So... What's up, pal? I'm going to try it in groups, see if more people get it. See if more people hop in here. We'll see how so it Oh, so loud. No reason. Yeah, I'll do some personal breaks. All the minis are up, guys. Or all the Pops Chrome, Prestige Football, uh, Optic Baseball, uh, Donruss Basketball. Uh, we're tick trickling forward on the baseball break. Uh, I'd be glad to do that this evening. Uh, let me update the numbers. Chad bought two. We're down to 16 on the baseball break. Um, that's the Topps Chrome. It's $20. It's on the website. Uh, if you're interested in getting in, then uh, please do so. Uh, it makes it go a little bit quicker. Um, just hopped on for a little bit. Uh, Gave away 20 bucks in poker as, as per usual. Um, watching Milwaukee and Dallas play to see if we can push any breaks closer to the finish line. I'm trying to get in y'all's head. Tell me, I think I just about to annoy you. Yeah, I do all right, but there's a lot of people. We get 14, 15 people in it, so anybody's got a laptop or a PC, um, we'll get you in the next one if you're interested. Like I said, it's 20 bucks, winner take all, winners take all, so you just try to have a little fun with it. Uh, I did. Uh, the Optic Mega Box is up there. I need to adjust my camera a little bit, but the Optic Mega is up there. I think it's only like fifty bucks. Yeah, uh, two of the blasters left, guys, on the pre-sale at hundred bucks. If you're interested.
Yeah, we'll shoot you a link, Chad. We have fun with it. So. Uh, channel. Uh, sorry, just trying to get everything up here. Yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I think I am loud as I'm gonna get over here. Uh, yeah. All right, I believe everything is up at this point. I think I got Instagram working again. Yeah, I can do some personals. Like I said, just trying to hop on and see if we can push the break. Uh, Chad actually bought a few spots here. Oh, let me fix chat. Chat doesn't seem to be working. Uh, there it is. What's up, Facebook. What's up, Mr. Pool? Yeah, if you um, if you're wanting to get in on the uh, hockey, we'll be glad to open one up for you or send it out to you. Just let us know. So. Or if you want to get the break going. Uh, Chuck will definitely buy some if you're in in on it. So Chuck's a big hawk, hockey man. So like I said, we can we do ship them out. Just make sure you let us know. It is. Um, there's only six spots. I guess I can pull up the picture here. There's only six spots up on the thing um, in the hockey, and we kind of tiered the teams out, so there's six divisions. Um, I got four boxes, TJ. Four boxes of it. Let me turn. Oh, close this door here. Share. Now, public share to a page. There we go. Uh, watching this basketball game is about it today anyways yeah if, if you may want to do personal rips I'm down just trying to get on maybe push some breaks a little bit closer um, I'm about convinced I'm about to take the baseball break down um,
Uh, every, I think I've done. I think I got everything on the website today. So if anybody's interested in getting some personals going, be glad to you open them up. So. Just hanging out here waiting to see if anything moves along. I'd finished him first. Um, uh, no, we got three of those left on the blaster boxes, the Chronicle blaster boxes. We got three of those left, um, four on the Chronicle, um, I'm sorry, four on the S&P hockey, if somebody just wants to open it up, so, uh, what'd you get, two of them? Him. Cool. Chuck will be excited. Let me tag Chuck. I sure can. Sure can, buddy. Let me, uh, I'll let you pick the one you want to rip and the one you want to ship. We got four here. One or one, two, three, four. Pick your rip and pick your ship. Give me a number on them. I tag Chuck. Chuck wanna. Chuck's big into hockey, so we'll let him uh, join in on somebody else's excitement. Two and four. It says rip two. I'm going to put this one in your bin. Mr. Poole, there you go. Four's in your bin. All right, good luck here. I kind of know. Kinda know who we're looking for in this stuff. And I've lost my razor blade yet again. Ugh. Oh, must have hit the thing. Good thing it wasn't the hand cam, right? There I am. Hello. Hello. All right. Sorry about that. Have to get the old meat cleaver out here. Do some whacking. You probably are more aware. I know a little, a little bit about it, but I wouldn't say I'm hit to it. I know the guy from, uh, who's it, the Oilers. Is that it? 
I know Hughes. Uh, who else? Hopefully, I'm better at when I see him remembering it. Man. They do a good job of getting their packs in, don't they? All right, so if I miss a good rookie, let me know here. Usually, if Chuck's around, he does the hockey in. Nico Hishier. Is that a little purple variant? John Klingberg. 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 Got it. Authentic profiles. Blue is not numbered. I think that's just a pack insert. Elias Peterson. Jeff Skin. See, I got these names. <laughs> All right. If I missed anybody, let me know here. Or any good cards. I should have read the odds a little bit. Me and... Uh... Alright. John to Quick. Fast, but not quick. Nico this year. Barrett. Hayton, S&P rookie. Could be the greatest player ever. Uh, I gotta be honest, don't really know. Joe Thornton and Artima Panarian. <laughs> Nailed it. No, I don't hear no shit either, Chuck. I'm getting here and say I mispronounced it. Go ahead. You know you're supposed to be opening the hockey anyways. Man, I hate this. People can say whatever they want about. Hang on one second here. Let me cheat a little bit. They don't make no mistakes on the opening. I feel like I have heard of the Hayton guy. Hayton. How is he? Best player ever. Drew Oliver. Jonathan Quick, another, well, there's a Hughes. I don't think it's the right Hughes, is it? Or is it Quinn Hughes? I think I'm thinking about Matt, is it Matt? Matt Hughes? He plays for a red, is it the Devil Rays? I think that's him right there, ain't it? On the pack. Thomas Hurdle, Rasmus Dalen, Dalen, Drew Dowdry. I think this guy's pretty good, ain't he? Mick, Mick Love, Mick Love, Make, Make Love. I think that's his name. We've got some rookies. Just sleeve those up for you. Again, if I miss a big time rookie, make sure you let me know. I know. Was it Makar? Makar? No, him. The Hughes from the Devils. So what is our rookie of pack? Seems like we E rookie. Nikita. Exclusive. Rasmus Sandin. So two rookies. He's got quite a bit on the rookies. Joe. And Roman Yossi. A little help here, guys. A little help. You got me sitting over here like I'm Stephen F. and Glansberg on hockey. We, we, we want to learn, too. We've been watching a lot of hockey, trying to get hip to all you cool kids and cats and kittens. Oliver but Yorkstrand, a little patch rookie. Nicholas Haig, defenseman. Authentic profiles. Cam Atkins. Oh no. Some autograph patch. Makatov, Mok some, some, something like that. I'll go back to the rookies. I've got all the rookies and stuff set aside. Henrik 
Thomas Hurdle, Joe Ferreira Bay, Billy Enola, Enola, French. We've got a bunch of rookies. Just, and Braden Sheen. Is that Charlie Sheen's son? No. Yeah, you got a. I, don't, I think it's supposed to be like one rookie a pack. Who sent me a message? Oh, now Joseph shows up. Now, now he comments. Yeah, appreciate. <laughs> Thank you. I was sitting in the uh, bathroom today just reading off hockey names. Reminds me of this uh, time I was in college and uh, working as a janitor part-time and the professor would uh, write math problems on the board and I'd just, I'd solve them and try not let nobody catch me doing it, you know. Tobias Bjorn Fott, Bjorn Fott. Bjorn fought. That's got to be it. Like, there's no other way to say that. It probably flows a little bit better than I said it, but. Nathan McKinnon. All right. You sure you don't want to rip that other one, TJ? Bunch of rookies here. Let me start sleeving them. We still have the uh, breakup. Um, I'll have to pick up some more stuff. I gotta pick it up. We do have the hobby box if anybody wants to get into that, because now I gotta get more blasters, anyways, which should be able to. You sh I was just messing with you. You sure, TJ? Do I need to sleeve the McKinnon? Right. It's up to you, TJ. Well, I sleeved it anyways, Chuck, so it's on you. Let me sleeve up all these rookies here. I'll let you decide by the if you really want to, TJ. Sleeving all these rookies here. All right, we'll open it up. Give me a minute. Let me get all your rookies at least sleeved up. Let me know who's the uh, bigger rookies, and I'll put them in top loaders too. It's too late. I'm already committed to a penny sleeve. I've heard of this Nicholas Haig. I need to know more about him. 215 left handed December the 5th, 1998, Kitchener, Ontario. That's Canada, folks. A little north of the border. So I got me a little side table and I didn't bring it in, so that's cool. Eventually we'll get there. Is it typical to be this many rookies? I think we got like 15 rookies. It's probably a little bit high, but we did get a bunch. Four more here. You ever get a uh, William calm down, Charlie? He was pretty animated. All 
All right, got all your rookies penny sleeved up here. We'll go back through them here. You let me know. Anybody need to top load? Authentic profiles. No, that's not a rookie. I'm new. I don't know what to do. Why is Peterson? Oh. Barrett Hayton. Quinn Hughes. Ilya. Milkley. Rasmussen, Sandin, Nikita, Gusev, Nicholas Haig, Cam Atkinson, Villa Hinola, Joel Faraby, Tobias Bajornfot. All right, you let me know who you want out of those uh, top loaded. All right, we're gonna open up your other box here for you. Let me know by the time I get back if you don't want to break it. Oh. All right, one more box. Good luck. Said I know the, the huge rookies. Oh, we will. We will. Yeah, we're trying to get some breaks going on it. Um, Chuck's big into hockey. I'm trying to figure it out. So you just have to bear with me on the names. It's one of those kind of melting pots. They're not used guys, they're just great to clip a pack. Upper Deck does a real good job of keeping their pack sealed. Yeah, we, sent, we ship everything, man. Hits, non-hits. Try to sleeve up most rookies. We had some allure. I think Chuck bought most of it. I got in there on a few packs here and there. Oh. All right, got them pre-snipped here. Taylor Hall, Jonathan Manchu, Leon Drashtel, I'm going to butcher the names until I get them right, Sergei Bobrovsky, feel good about that, Alex Took, you're doing terrific, Connor, Claude, Ross, didn't we already see this guy once? Tuevo. These are good looking cards though. S&P makes a good card, man. It's just, there's, their uh, restrictions on who can buy their product is so wild. Who? Nice Bob. I have to go back and look for it. Pretty sure it's the second time we've seen this guy too. Ryan O'Reilly and Tyler Bertuzzi. I missed this guy. I'll go back and look. Tom Wilson, Quinn Hughes. Is it a repeat? I feel like. All these rookies I've called out so far. Come on. Give us a little change of pace here. Philip Myers. Didn't call him out. Leon Drashtel and Matt Dumba. 
Alright, you said I missed somebody. McDavid. See you, the father at McLovin. Connery. You look. Damn, Atticons. Trevor Moore. The rookie, Tara Rose. You a numbered one. That about didn't catch that. Is this guy any good? It's numbered. 1199 803 of Neski, Adam Boofquist, and the Patch, and Tobias Bajorn Font. I'll go back and look for this Bob. Reminds me of the drop Bob. Mikhail. Grandland, Matt Dumba, Bill Hanola, I know we got him in the last one, and William and Tom. All right, you said I missed some McDavid guy. Let's go back here. Could have been right here somewhere. Honor McDavid. All right, there's who I missed. My bad. Yeah, I think it's what, an auto patch or an auto. Find one autographed jersey or... But we still got two boxes of it. I'll do a box war with somebody. Get the beginner's luck going here. Anybody wants to do a box war? We will do... How are these? We get weird. We could do tallest player. Weight being tiebreaker, if anybody wants to do that. Like that guy's 6'4". Six 6'4". Four. Six four. Anybody want to do that on that other box? There's, so there's two boxes left. Or I can even, if the hockey guys are interested in doing it, I'll do it just to have a little fun with it. I'll, I'll learn quicker if I got a little skin in the game. Yeah, we got two of the blasters left on the S and P. Suns moved to five and zero. Oh. All right, TJ, Chuck, you guys want to do a uh, box war? We'll do a tallest player. Whoever hits the tallest player win, wins the box. Wins both boxes. Hope you got some good ones, TJ. Like I say, I don't really know, but anybody wants to try a box where I'll do it with you, we'll do tallest player. So we'll open up my box and whoever I get, let's say they're six three, then we'll open up your box and all your players. If they're six four, then you would win both boxes. But if they were six two, 
then I would win both boxes. And we can do that type of stuff on any of the, uh, if you're not familiar with how wars work, you can do them highest card number, uh, heaviest player, uh, who gets the lowest numbered card. Uh, just a way to gamble a little bit. Yep, three of the uh, $100 Blaster Chronicles left, guys. So, if anybody wants to get in on that. Yeah, so we're I'm pre-selling five total. We've already sold two of the Chronicles, if anybody's interested. I uh, doing them for a hundred dollars a piece. I think I'll be able to get into your stuff on Thursday, but don't hold me to that. Yeah. It is all live. Uh we did. I um Mr. Chad Bay opened some stuff. Nothing crazy, but got a few little somethings. So there, there is 40 cards in the blaster box. That's what's going to make them go so crazy. Just because the base ions are going to be 100. And at 40 cards, you have a decent enough chance. I mean... I'd say almost one in every other box further how many cards are out and how many cards you get in a box. Somebody bought my 1718 blaster box. Mm -mm. I was just talking about Mr. Bay. Uh, he's back in on the hanger. Got one more pack of the elite. All right, let me set all this stuff to the side. Thanks again, TJ. If I need to top load any of those guys, let me know. Uh, hopefully we can get everything out Monday, Tuesday. So, I mean, it just costs so much to ship stuff. We really only ship once, once a week. All right, so you got a hangar elite and the blaster box. Blaster's over there. Got the hangar you my bad. Oh. Yep, yeah, we enjoy having people. We're still pretty new, man. We've only been around uh, probably not quite three months, so our growth has been pretty impressive. So we tried to Try to treat everybody pretty fair, so as fair as we can. All right, I uh, had a blaster there. I'll do your blaster here last. Just getting it open. You got a fat pack too. Uh, let's do the elite football first. 
No CeeLo. Huh. Did you get a CeeLo? Oh. Miss. What? I'll get confused. Now it says hanger box Donruss blaster 1718 and backpack. That's right. Come on, my homies. I hate it. So frustrating. Why do they do this? All right. Fournette, there's a good one to start out with. Another decent one, OJ. Cannon. Gary Goff, that's eh, not the rookie. It's supposed to be on Chrome. If you don't get anything, if you have some bad cards here, I'll give you one. Because I'm a generous guy. If we don't get no big hits here, I'll get you a CeeLo. Matt Ryan. Out of the whole of thing. So if you get one big hit, too bad, so sad. Cunningham. All right. Nothing crazy out of the first one. We'll save your blaster to last. We are, we're actually getting low on the hanger boxes, which I thought I'd never say because I had like 7,000 of them. <sighs> All right, here we go. D. Gordon. McKay. Puerto and Silver Toro. I like Toro. Toro's a good card. And it been in the silver. Decent card. Gordy. Come on, be a good one. No, nope. silver. Silver Prism. No big name, though. All right. Three more chrome hanger packs to go. Got a little die cut coming up. Pukey on the back. We'll take a pukey. Come on, Ink. Hmm. Oh, Honus Wagner. The good looking puke in the silver. All right, two decent cards there. We still got to get the hit, though. Peralta. Edmund, Nick Horner, and Blake Snell in the silver. M. Anderson, come on, man. Thought it was him. Jansen, Jose Ramirez, and future stars Carter Kaboom. Carter's played okay. Still got the blaster to go. Yeah, I'm sending everybody's coupon. Soto. There's Alvarez. I think you've got like 12 of those at this point. Who's it? Ben Simmons. There's another really big rookie in here. I'll know it when I see it. Yeah, Busel. Justin Jackson, not a bad one. Oh, pink here. 
Oops. Dave DeBruyne, Retro, CJ McCollum, Mario Chalmers, Kevin Love, and Jabari. Juan Evans, I don't even know if that guy's still in the league. Willie Colley Stein and Damian Dotson. Oh. Harden Court Kings, Lamarcus Aldridge. Sure. Oh, Gordon Hayward. Is he out for the year? Yeah, I seen he got hurt, but. There's another big rookie in here. The ball's in here. Ball's good, but he's not on those two's level. Who is it? Ben Simmons. The rookie variation. Speak of the devil and he shall appear. Ben Ben, this may be, is this the Tatum draft? Is that what I'm thinking? I think this is the Tatum draft. Let me look here for I give you some bad information. Pretty sure it's the Tatum draft now that I think about it. Jordan Bell, Frank Mason, Washington Wizards, Moon Day, Tim Hardaway. So B.I. was in that draft, then it was, was Tatum next. So yes, yeah, the Tatum, Josh Hart, the Lakers, Josh is a good one. Thomas Bryant. Vince Carter, Dougie McBuckets, Reggie Miller, Jeremy Lynn, and Lance Wynn. All right, about half the way through. Demo, I like it. He's playing well. He's a good one. I think he's still with the Celtics, ain't he? I know I hear him. Say his name every time I watch. Wesley Awundu. Right? B.I. So, yeah. It's the Tatum draft. My bad. Still good ones in here. The next one would have been the um, Luca draft. Derek what? Come on. You can't. This guy's playing out his mind right now. I'm afraid to pronounce his name. A little Shaq here. The retro series. I'll take it. Anyway, God, has that been that long since he was on the Bulls? Greg Monroe and Jamal Murray. What was wrong with him, Chad? Was it, uh, I seen the injury and stuff, but got your patch coming up here. Sterling Brown, rookie. Read rookie jerseys. Luke Kenyard. Luke Kenyard still playing. Pushed a couple all star teams. I don't think he's ever actually made it. Josh Jackson. Good player. Armello, Trevor, and Trevor Booker. La la Three more packs left here. If we don't get a big hit, I will get you a CeeLo, but we got time. We're going to hit it. Tony Bradley. Eric Bledsoe in the gold. Is that numbered? Not. Julius Randle. Boogie. Andre.
Boogie, boogie, boogie. Joel Embiid. Here you guys. Frank the Tank Jackson. Couple Dukies. Chauncey Billups. All right, give us a Tatum. Tatum's a monster. Yeah, I seen it was. It didn't look like nothing major to me, but you know what that means. So uh, nothing. Kyle Kuzma, I'll take it. Two on Bonnie's. All right, Reggie, Giannis. Eh, I'm just leaving Giannis. Any Giannis is sleepable. Especially his earlier stuff. It's one more. Let me put these up and I'll grab you a CeeLo here. Give me a minute. Put a little hot hands on this one. All right, here's your bonus bad break, $100 combination CeeLo here. I only have eyes for you. That's why I like Chrome. There's five or six really good rookies in here. Kyle Lewis, man. I don't know. Like, I like Robert, and I get it, but, like, you can't let Kyle Lewis put up MVP numbers as a rookie, or a card rookie, and just keep ignoring him. Colin Moran. Bogarts. Ooh, nice. Good one. A little silver trouty trout. Definitely a sleever there. Any trout variation is a good card. Akuna, piece, piece. The blue, or is that just the print? Uh, just the print. All right. Whit Merrifield, Alex Bregman, and Brian Reynolds. I have not seen a good pink card yet, just to be honest. So goat, goat warning. So we thought this was a gold variation. All of them look like this. I guess it's just the dirt and the chrome that makes it look gold. Luis Arias, Andrew Benintendi, and the goat. I watched like three of his at bats today, man. His plate discipline is just. It's absurd. It's absurd. His team sucks, but I think he was like three for four with two walks, maybe. He did strike out looking, which you'll never see, but it was a perfect 97 mile an hour fastball in the black. We may have our first good pink here. Seen a little, a little goody good on the back. There he is. Nice. Definitely the. Bonus bad break belt bell gel a little bit bobo nice get them sleeved up for you I'll put your bow in the top loader grab some pennies 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 <laughs> what is Carolina Bluff? What you mean?
I don't I don't know, pal. Got me. We'll sleeve your uh trouty trout here. Sleeve the trout in the bow. Or uh top load them for you. I don't know what is a Carolina. I'm not following you, pal. Oh. I'm slow, John. You gotta explain stuff to me like I'm five. Oh, oh, I'm bad. My bad. It's up on the website. I think it's only fifty. It's optic, so it's panini. So there's not there's not the logos, but they got a bunch of exclusives in here, like white parallels. Um, who else is in here? So optic has um, rated prospects, so you can get like a Bobby Witt. Um, who else? Uh, Dominguez, any of the big prospects, you can get those. And that's what everybody's looking for in those. It's on the website, though, Chad. I only have for you. I know. It's, uh, let's see here. Radio rookie signature. Rated prospect. Yeah, that's what it's called. Allo. Pink Velocity Rated Prospects Purple Orange Carolina numbered 125 to 1. It's right around 50. I can't remember exactly what it is, Chad, but a bunch of cards in Eight packs of four cards with so 40 cards in a box. I only have for you. Can't believe nobody do a uh, pack war with me on the hockey or blaster box. You guys are rude. Rude. So we got the uh, reserves up, boys and girls. I tried to get him to, Chad, he wasn't. Like, I'm leaving.
Yeah, it does pretty good. Does all right. I'm fine. I got me a little 10 minute nap. Boo -boo -boo. Own blaster. Alright, that's fine. Yeah, just let me know when you're back, Chad, and I'll get your stuff going. Uh, baseball break is going pretty quick, guys. It's only 20 a spot. I think you can get three teams for like 55 bucks. That's cool, Chad. Like I said, just let me know whenever you're done having a smoke and a pancake. Yeah, just let me know when you're back, Chad. We'll throw it open for you. Uh, guys, we do, we have one or three more. Um, I think John was interested in the spot, but he hadn't uh, donated yet, so. Yeah, just tag me when you get back, Chad. Luca. Luca's playing out of his mind, man. Robert. Uh, just wait on him to get back here.
Alright, Mr. Chad is back. Alright, you wanna do which one you wanna do first? Mega or the blaster? Blaster or Mega, just let me know, Chad. All right, so Mega first. Good luck here. wide out here. Willie Calhoun, Raymond Lorado, and Dylan Carson, rated prospect. Watch the show with this guy. So this is the wide out variation. Good looking card. So. What's up, pal? Uh, uh, you want to buy a box of the Chronicles? Oh, in stock? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> the great question. Um, are you looking for baseball? That's really the only thing we want. Give me a second. The rookies, Bo Bichette and Silver. Nice. Nice card. Debbie Gruron. Uh, we got some clearly... Some tier. Um, hang on one second. I'll look for you. Yeah, the Chronicles. We don't have them now, though, uh, John. Um, but we will on Thursday. So, Mike Trout and the White. I like it. Rated rookies. Rated rookies. Randy Arzanio. Add to there, Brian and Bray. You um, give me just one second here, and we'll pull it up for you. You said you don't like the Gypsy Queen, do you, John? We got some higher tier stuff, but it was in the break. But we we'll have time to replace it. Jose Ramirez, Steven Strasburg, Acuna, and Ronald Blonus. Hold on, give us a big rated prospect here. We do have a bunch of the Chrome stuff on the website, John. I know. The Chrome's, there's some really good stuff in it. It's all the Series 1, Series 2 top stuff. But, uh, Chrome version. Sterling Marte, Kirby, Puckett, and the Donris, and Sam Hilliard, and the rated rookie. Trey Mancini, Kevin Mitchell, and Bob Bradley from the White House. Bob Bradley had led the minors for like three years in a row. Jonathan Davis in the auto. Nice. 
Signature Series Outfielder, Jonathan Davis, Otto. Nice. Alec Bregman. A little Juan Soto in the white. Wide out parallel. And these are more, so they have the rated prospects in the optics, so you're more looking for the uh, Dominguez's and the Wits. Those are the bigger ones in these. Don't get me wrong, you'd definitely take a Robert, but. Joey Gala, Eddie Murray, and Pete Alonzo. All right, we got your bonus pack. I really don't know what's in them. Dang it. It's a bunch, whatever it is. Oh, these are the blues. Come on, give us a good rookie. Mitch, JD, Clayton, Jonathan Hernandez. A little Aaron Judge in the light blue. I like it. Christian Yelich and also let me get this. Aaron. Aaron's playing out of his mind too. Those are good looking cards though. Oh, did you send that, John? I hadn't, no. Uh, I really hadn't looked, though, either. I think I just heard something beat the... Uh, I did, pal. I got it. All right, guys. One spot left on the uh, Chronicles. Um, Let me get his last here. Yeah, John, look up. Like I said, man, we won't have it until... We might get it Wednesday, so I don't... You know, I'd rather tell you it be later and surprise you and get it earlier. Um, there's there's even a chance we get some Monday and Tuesday. Cause I'm literally going to ride around this state of North Carolina all day long. So uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. We'll we'll say that we have a uh, some hookups Thursdays and Fridays. So that's why I feel more confident about it. Uh, Chad, it's the it's a pre-order on the Chronicles. Yeah. All right, Chad, take care, pal. Yeah, I'll open it in the order you reserved it. So, so if I get you know two of them or three of them, these are still your cards, Chad. Chris Bryant, Marza, and Chapman. Still got to get through. Uh, yeah, me too, John. I just, I mean, I love Zion. He's my favorite, one of my favorite players ever. Um, but I just hate the way that they're handling him right now. The guy's 19, 20 years old. Yeah, I'll be finishing opening your stuff up here, Chad. But, I mean, the whole time I've said Jaws a better investment than Zion is. Zion has more upside, but I just hate the way they're handling him. Arenado, Carrera, little Pete Alonzo in the Silver Prison. Not bad. Yeah. I just like him because he plays hard, man. And you know it's killing him not getting the play and stuff. And I think you can do more harm to a player's mental than you can good. I mean, I understand what they're trying to do, but a little silver parallel, Mike Trout, 35th anniversary. Nice, a little bias. Good player. Yeah, I mean, it's tough to... You know, Marco Adron. Ah, yeah, it's nice. Good card. Um, and I like him at Duke because he played. They done the same thing. They really. Yeah, I'll check it out once I get off of here, Chad, and see if uh, it's a good investment for me. Austin Riley. How much is it up to? Logan Webb. 
Guys, we got one reserve left on the Chronicles. I need to update my spreadsheet as soon as I get done. Um, $100 a box. They're going anywhere from $150 to $175 already on eBay. So, it's just going to keep going up. Hmm, nice. Little Seth Brown. On card auto. I love the autos on the Chrome. Nice. I reckon they're all. Seth Brown's playing good, man. Yeah, I'll definitely, uh, I'll look in there. I know you got the, uh, Court Kings. Yeah. Toddy. There's a Kyle Lewis. We'll take Kyle. Definitely got better last couple packs there. Alright. What do we have? Are you, uh... I don't even have this stuff up, man. I'd have to look like every bit of this stuff up. We do have some clearly authentic. Yep. Uh, this is some of the baseball. We got some tier one. Tier one's um, kind of higher tier stuff. It's only three cards. It's two autos, one relic. Um, the clearly authentic. Man, I have to look this stuff up. I it's, it's been a while since I put it up, so I'd be afraid to tell you. Top's clearly authentic, which is one auto, one card, um, top case, top sleeve. Um, got a box of Gypsy Queen, a box of Topps Heritage, a box of Topps Series 1. Um, if you're still interested or if you just you just went with the Chronicles. It's, it's one card. One card, man, it's an autograph. It's basically a hit. You can kind of see, this is what it comes out like. It's an autograph, uh, top loaded with a top clearly authentic sticker over the top. So they print the card, put it in the top loader. Here's the hit odds. Mm. So, I don't know. And the tier one, I don't even, the clearly authentic's up on the website. The t tier one was part of a break, um, but I can replace it in time, so. Yeah. That's fine. Um, these are up on the website, John. It's one card, one auto. Um, I mean, you can roll it off. I don't really know about a way to split it, but um, the tier one, man, I spend, that was part of a break like a month ago. So let me look it up. I don't really even know. I don't even know on that one. Uh, it's, it's just one card, John. That's uh, one hit. 
the autograph hit. This is basically so one encased autograph acetate card per box. This is basically what it looks like. So there's really no way to buy buy half of that. And this one is a tier one. It's two autographs, two autograph cards, and one relic. So, a bunch of tops chrome up on the website. I do have a Gypsy Queen. All right, there's, there's no packs in those guys. It's, it's three cards. Well, this is a pack, but it's it's just this one's only got one card a box. This one's got three. Yeah, that's what I was trying to look up, John. I know it's... Brother Little Little. I'm trying to find it. Give me a second. Yeah, I had it in the break, so I apologize, but I apologize, but. Uh, uh. And I didn't know that about it. Hang on, let me look it up. I'll do one eighty five on the tier one. Somebody wants to buy it. Uh, the clearly authentic's on the website. I think it's somewhere it's around sixty or seventy bucks. Um, let me look. See what the clearly authentic is. Uh, the clearly authentic seventy four dollars a box. This will be one eighty five. Again, guys, it's only three cards. There's no pack. Well, it's a pack, but there's three cards in it. Um, two autographs and one relic. This they're both. They're basically just all hit boxes. Yeah. yeah, they're up on the website. Let me make sure there's two of them. Yeah, just 
just in case you didn't hear me chat, it's, it's one hit per box. So it's one card a box. It's an autographed card. Um, you can get into different variations, etc., etc. But yeah, just send it through PayPal or Venmo. Um, that's fine. You've ordered. 400 bucks, so. Uh. Oh, I'm trying to figure out something. Yeah, Chad, I owe you a CeeLo, so earlier um, I'll do his since his is open first does the CeeLo work to offset your cost Yeah, I see it, Chad, just making sure I got it right. Uh, Chad, is Facebook chat not working? All right. Did you send yours already? Getting a little behind here, so bear with me, guys. All right. Yeah, I'll do 175 on that, John, if you want to PayPal or Venmo it to me. All right, let's do your CeeLo first. Yeah, it seems to be working now. Uh, Facebook's been having some issues, so if I'm slow on the chat, let me know. If you want the tier one, um, send it up. Red Rover, Red Rover. In Aurora, there's a little trouty trout. Mm. Thought we got us another silver prison. Good pack. Yeah, you're fine. I like the authentic. It's just it is only one card, so you don't, you know, you live and die. Uh, Eloy. Oh. Shohei Atana, nice. Eddie Rosario, I'm Dolly, and Ron Anderson. All right, pink pack. You finally did get a good rookie out of the pinks. Chrome are good. Chrome's really good. Just like anything, you gotta get the right variations, but Labella. Alright, not much out of that one. It just means we're building up for the clearly. It's the first time I've opened these, so I'm kinda excited about it. Hopefully get a a monster out of here. really know how it's labeled here. Am I going to cheat? I think I'm going to cheat on you. I know who it is. Here we go. Bobby Bradley. Nice. Act take clear. 
I just talked about this guy being a monster. Number to 50. On card. It's such a wild card you can't even see into it. That's the acetate. Number to 50. Yeah, you don't always get a numbered card out of these. Bobby Bradley has huge power. Nice. Love it. Love it. Good card. Power wise, Bobby Bradley's going to probably average 40 homers run 40 a year they just didn't bring him up because the rule of five i think he's like 24 25 he's still a young guy yeah that's a cool card and we'll get that one back out and look at it i'm gonna cheat again i like to ruin the surprise Number to 99, another rookie, Jake Rogers. I thought it was Robert because I seen the uh, Robert and I seen like the black pinstripes. I'll get ready to flip out on you. Rogers is playing well. It's another, because they're all the acetate. So they're the clear. Can you see my hands behind it? Number to 99, on card auto. Good looking cards, man. I guess that's why they call them clearly authentic. Number to 99. Yeah, it's good. The Bradley's the better one, but it's a lower number, too. These are such good looking cards. I really didn't know they were clear like that. That's awesome. Now I wish we had more. I probably can get more, though. No, I do. I have another box. I just didn't have it up on the thing. Yeah, I got one more box of that. Um, oh yeah, Mr. Roots was waiting. I might have to get you another bin, Chad. I, I ain't got a clue. The Bobby, Bobby Bradley's probably a pretty decent card. I'd say over a hundred pretty easily on the Bradley. I don't, I don't know for sure though, Chad. That's cool. Sorry, I was looking at the card. I might start you another bin here, Chad. You're out of control. You're out of control. It'd definitely be a first for us, Chad. It's the first time we've ever had to get a second bin. I mean, pretty good size of stuff. I think I'm going to owe you two shirts now, Chad. How'd oh, you send it over, John? This thing's slow as piss. We, we're having trouble in getting uh, t-shirts. Okay, you did send it. Weird. I didn't get a pop-up. Yeah, for some reason I didn't get a pop-up. That's, that's you. All right. All 
All right. Yeah, I'm sorry. I think my PayPal froze up too. First time I've opened this stuff too, also. I was... Anytime you get into the high end stuff, it's so hit or miss, man. I always feel. And I may show you what we actually have in this stuff. It's crazy how much this stuff costs. By the time we ship it to you, we'll be about dead even. All right. Good luck. Yeah, let me know if you freeze here. Yeah, I'm pulling for you, man. I hope we get to see one monster. Aaron, Aaron Nola, numbered on card auto, 147 to 200. Alex Bregman, patch, 142 to 395. Man of the Hour, another Bobby Bradley Gold on card auto. That's got massive power, 259, 299. Must be the Bobby Bradley now. It's a good card though. Nola can play, I just wish it was a different rookie. Definitely the best card out of it. He's batting about 300 last I looked. I don't know what his power numbers are, but he's got massive power. Yeah, gotta get him top loaded up. I just so I have to get my thick top loaders. Yeah, the Bobby Bradley saved you. He's got big power, man. What's up, Mr. Diaz? We are trying. We're moving along on the uh, mixer. Oh yeah, there's something I was going to update. Uh, only one left on the Chronicles, guys. Um, what do you mean, John? We got them up on the website. We got a bunch of blasters, um, bunch of silos. Uh, Eh, that's breaks, man. I think, didn't you have like a really monster break on the basketball? Did you get like a bunch of jaws and stuff like that? I mean, they're just, it's just like any card opening. Some's good, some's bad. Yeah, it's on the website. We got, but we got all three. We do have some personal chrome blaster boxes, some personal hanger boxes.
No, the first break you ever done with this, John. I know you had a really big break. All right, that chrome stuff is up on the website. I'm gonna go use the bathroom real quick. I will be right back. I will. I will, John. Yep. It's still kind of early for me. It's not too late. I get the where's the trash can man. I gotta get my the trash man to bring some trash cans up here. Yeah, I'm on for a while, so. Hey, will you go get that trash can off the uh, back of the back porch off the steps? Bring it up here, please. All right. Bye. Yeah, I'll go ahead and pull them up over here. Uh, in all honesty, John, that's kind of what I do. I do get lucky occasionally.
it's just fun, man. That's why we put up. I don't know if you've seen the dollar lotto stuff we're doing. It's uh, I mean, a lot of people financially can't afford to get into hundred, two hundred dollar breaks. Um, so we've got like dollar ones up. It's obviously a lot more tickets to get into. That's like autograph stuff. It's done pretty well, and it's way to kind of that cheap, fun entertainment. Uh, kind of give everybody a little something. Nah, I love you. Uh, yeah, the chrome. I love the chrome, though. The Bowman Chrome's really good too. Little we'll skip shot. Yeah, I mean, I'll be on long people are buying stuff, so I'm cool with that. I assume that was you, John. I appreciate it. Man's in on two blaster boxes. All right. We only got three on the left, so I'll let you pick it out here. One through three. One on the left. Two, three. One, two, and three. Let me know which ones you want. Let you pick it here. One and two, got it. Dude, we have opened so much of this stuff. You said you got some hanger boxes, is that right, John? The hangers are good. They got good odds. Not a lot of cards in them, but good odds. Oh, my bad. Sophia's last here. Oh, so you got value packs. Yeah. Value packs are, if you're just base rookie hunting, that value packs are the way to go. Now, if you're looking for big hits and stuff like that, you're better off on the hangers of the chrome. But if you're looking for a uh, big hit, Nuis, rookie out of the gate here. Trey Messini. Austin Riley. I don't know. Do you see his home run? I guess it was opening day, maybe opening day weekend. Man, he crushed that ball. I think it was 
I guess it wasn't Toronto, but against Toronto. Eloy, Newman, uh, cool card coming up here. Little die cut Babe Ruth. Nice. Well, Elo. You trying to talk out Robert? We've seen him a few times in these. He's here. We can confirm it. Matt Olson. Everest. Little oh, Key Boom. And Miles Malacolas. All right. Freeman, Lopez, eh, that's a good one. Toro in the silver. Toro's playing well. The one that I think everybody's sleeping on is Lewis, man. That guy is playing at an MVP level. And he's a rookie, and I just, I love Robert, but, like, I'm really big on Lewis right now because of the value you can, you can get him at. Lucas Gelato. There's another good one. Pukey. Ooh. Nope. I thought it was Lux. Damn it. Thought we got two good ones in a row there. Puke's good though. But the next time you catch uh, Seattle's game, watch um, Kyle Lewis. Guy's phenomenal, man. And he's back, his OPS is like a thousand. Um, three homers. Big numbers. Here's this card that always fools me. Art Bradley Springer. I think it's a gold, it's not, it's just the dirt. Makes it look like a gold variation. And Nomar Mazzara. Austin Nola. Noah's playing well too. Eddie Rosario, old Calvin, and a refractor Eddie Rosario. Come on, Robert, make an appearance. Corey Kluber, John Zabalara, David Peralta, and Kluber, uh, the aforementioned. Come on, we need to get on a good run here. Corbin. Corbin, my man. Corbin. Another silver prism. Johnson Villar and Boydia. Okay, Anthony, Trey Turner, another pukey. Elvis Andrews. Uh, you can go back and watch it, Jonathan. Um, decent cards, nothing crazy yet. Um, but, it, ooh, there's a nice base, Pukey. You did get a die cut Babe Ruth, and now you have a die cut Ricky Henderson. Nice. So you got that in the Babe Ruth also, the die cut. We're pulling for him. But yeah, I've been talking up Kyle Lewis. Kyle Lewis is outperforming him right now. So, Oh, there's a nice one. Nice. Heading in the right direction now. Jordan, base rookie. Good one. It's probably your best one so far. Santana and Brian Reynolds. Seaman, Bogarts, Anthony Rendon, and Tim. This card always fools me. <laughs> yeah, Jordan's a stud, man. Offensively, Jordan's far better than Robert is. 
He's just not the five-tool player that Robert is. But uh, Jordan had one of the best half seasons ever last year. Acuna, Mike Trout was over nice. Definitely take that. Jansen. All right, you got your Sophia packs left. Come on, give us it, give it to us. JD Martinez, little one Soto goat. The Sophia, good looking cards. They're wild though. Yeah, but Kyle Lewis is outperforming everyone. That guy's amazing. He's batting like 350. You no, know his OPS is over 900. Uh, three or four homers. Um, He's just, he's good. Come on, give us a good one here. Yeah. Rios and the Sophia. No, Robert, we did get a Yordan. We'll definitely take the Yordan. I like Jimenez. Yeah, I know. I know the one you're talking about. But. Just next time you catch Lewis, uh, the Mariners playing, watch this. Watch Lewis, man. I think a lot of people are sleeping on him. You can still get his cards pretty cheap. Um, next time we do like a good investment player, that's probably going to be our guy. Um, his cards are still on the cheap. Everybody's just so big on Robert. I think he's slipping under the radar. This guy's batting. I mean, his OPS is over 900. He hits with power. He runs with speed. I mean, he's a five-tool player that, you know, he's, he's just outperforming them. I mean, you put a side-by-side a -side stats, and there's not a category that Lewis hasn't been better in. The, the, the reason that everybody is so big on Robert, he just looks the part, right? Like, he looks like an outside triathlete. You know that just run through buildings and jump over them. The next one, I mean, it just looks that way. But um, Lewis just p keeps putting up numbers. It reminds me a lot of like the Trout and Bryce when they first come out. Everybody was so huge on Bryce Harper, and Trout just kept just putting up ungodly numbers. And it really does remind me a lot of that. So. And going to, that may be my last three hangers, Chad. Yeah. What do you think of the whole, uh, what's his name? Forgot his name. The guy that just skipped town. Ah, uh, what's his name? Damn it. Seth Spithers. Yeah, I just thought that was incredibly shitty. Yeah. I have one hanger box left after this, guys. I got one hanger, one blaster. Never on this, the silos. All right, guys, we are sold out on the Chronicles. I will open them in the order that you purchased them. Um, Chad, you're the second one. John, you're three and four. So hopefully I get them all, all Monday, but we'll see. I may even go right around a little bit tomorrow. Uh, 
That's what we're talking about, Chad. Lewis is a monster. I'll break out my Zion collection one day, Jonathan. Like I said, if we're talking investment, get Jaws. Get uh, PJ Washington. Get uh, Ruiz. Uh, but like I said, man, I just love Zion. I love the way he plays the game. He plays correctly. There's no... You watch him after, you know, the games. It's not me, 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 or I'm the greatest. Or He just seems like a likable person. Um, here's your CeeLo. Chat. Chat. Chat will be done me in a minute telling me you didn't get it. So. Yeah. I said the same thing about Lewis. And a lot of times... I would say uh, more times than not, I'm not wrong about this. Oop, about to forget one. So, I, I would say our track record on our investment advice has been pretty much 100. So, all right, just making sure. Chad, be like, you sure? You sure I got that? Yeah, he, he, it's, I hold my breath, man, every time he does something weird, like every time he jumps off the wrong foot, or, but I do, I, like I say, man, I just love the way he plays, I wish all NBA players played like that, wasn't a head case, no drama, just goes out and plays because he loves basketball, or whatever sport it is, like I don't, I'm not a fan of the other stuff. Yeah, I was watching that game. Um, I, I think that was a part, part of a bad shoe design and part of a bad uh, part. I mean, he put so much torque, man. He, he weighs three hundred pounds and jumps out of buildings. Like you best have a damn good shoe to withstand all that. John Murphy, who's this? This is. Chad Bay, Bay is life. Devers, I really don't know what packs we're opening here, but I know it's all you, so. Yeah. yeah he, he literally jumped out of his shoe. The light, hang on, I thought it was him. All right. Albies, Kepler, oh, Aaron Judge, Silver, we'll take it. Judge is playing crazy too. I'm gonna to try to find a bunch of the 17 stuff where he's a rookie in it. I'm not a big high strikeout guy. Matthew Boyd, Jack Clarity, Cody Bellinger, and Alonzo. Yeah, I think you had told me that, and that slipped my mind. Yeah, I mean, I grew up on baseball. Baseball's still my, uh, I don't know, I just my, my comfort blanket. Like, there's, very rarely in the day you'll go, I won't have a baseball game on when baseball's being played. I just like it on in the background, man. Makes, makes me feel like a kid again. Yeah, not much so far. Come on, game. I played AAU with uh, Josh Hamilton, and he hit a baseball. I hate Josh Hamilton, right? Like, um, I like Alonzo. It's just he's been struggling. Like, you've been watching baseball. You've seen this. But uh, Josh Hamilton, he was a couple years younger than me. We were at a AAU tournament um, down in Raleigh, which is exactly where he's from. Uh, and he had a baseball that I swear to God that I don't know if it's landed yet. Um, I mean, I, 
it, and it sounded different too. Like, and that's when I knew that he was different than the rest of us. He was like two or three years younger. And it was aluminum bats and all that stuff. Um, but he, he had it to baseball 450 feet as a 14, 15 year old. And uh, I mean, the guy was the number one pick. Could have been one of the Hall of Famers. One of the greatest players ever, but man, he, it just, it just, I can't explain to you how it sounded when it come off his bat, but it sounded different than everyone else that I've ever heard hit a baseball. Um, yeah, I was a fan of his, like I PC this stuff, but I don't know if, did you hear the last thing where he, uh, uh, beat the shit out of his daughter and I uh, told, uh, told her to tell the police so she wouldn't be able to come back over anymore. I mean, come on, man. Like, like, one of my favorite memories of baseball was that All-Star game. Um, where he just, in, in, in Yankee Stadium, where he just kept hitting in the home run derby. He just kept hitting homers, kept hitting homers. I'm like, I literally just put all my shit on eBay and sold it, like, the next day when I read that story. Yeah, man, I, I've, unfortunately, I've, People's had their fair share in my family, but I can't. I just can't imagine getting to that point where you're. His daughter was like 14, 15 years old, and uh, just beat the shit out of her and told her to tell the police so she wouldn't be able to come back over. I don't know, man. Like I just, I can't. I hope I've. If I ever got to that point, I hope I would have enough courage to go ahead and check myself out. Well, that's the the police report. That was the specifics. She had physically had her ass beat. And he admitted to telling her to tell the police so she wouldn't be allowed to come back over. So, seems pretty specific to me. Logan Webb. Yeah, hey, we got heat up here. Sorry. Hamilton broke my heart a little bit on that stuff, so I'm, it's a little it's a little too fresh for me. Like I said, I played against him when I was younger, and you know, some of my best memories of baseball as I was older was of him. Ooh, we, got, we got a little black sleeve coming. Ah, it's not him. Damn it! Come on, game. Keep back up here. We were doing so well. Yeah, that. Oh yeah, he's definitely a druggie, alcoholic, all that stuff. But you know, I'll, I'll pull for you to a certain extent. So Raymond Laureano, Ferreira, Lazardio, he's pitched well. Scherzer. Aaron, did you see the, uh, was it the 30 for 30? That was pretty crazy. On Hernandez, Kepler, Uchang, Ensign, Alberto. Come on, game. Let's get back to it. Henny, too long, card auto. Nice. Well, I like the hangers. Roger Armadros. Guy pitched well. Well, let's see. He actually pitched really well in the playoffs for him. Don't have the best regular season stats. Is he a starter? Yeah, he's a starter. That's nice card. On card auto there. About five more packs after this one. Then we got your bonus packs. Bellinger. Aquino's another big power guy. We like Aquino.
Guayas Belt and Ryan Hoskins. I don't think he is. Um, Poison is. And he's he's one of my favorites in the minors, but I don't. The, all right, so here's why you're not going to see him is because the rule of five. The A's is. The A's do, do this to every player in their system. Because um, they can hang on to them for a year longer. Let them mature a little bit more and bring them up and give them a year or two. And uh, ship him out of town. The reason I like Soto is um, little Elo. The reason I like Soto so much is I look at like his um, draft cards. Dude, the guy look like like a high schooler. Um, just. No weight on him. He'd been lucky to weigh 140. Um, I mean, he literally looked like a 14, 15 year old, which he probably wasn't much older at that time. Um, but the guy's plate discipline was amazing. You couldn't get him out in the minor leagues. So he had this great eye, always made good contact with the ball, but he was just, he weighed 125 pounds soaking wet, and he wasn't a man. Um, so when you're looking at young guys to collect uh, like the drafts and stuff look for people like that people with just great hand-eye coordination because physically they'll mature eventually and that's what happened to him like this guy had all his scouting reports were no power uh, couldn't do this couldn't do that call him up first year he puts on like 60 pounds hits 30 homers and he still has that amazing plate discipline. What is that? Freshman Flash, Sheldon Luis. No, Poison is doing good, but that's the A's. The A's are gonna hang on to players. They're gonna get every penny out of them they can. Yelich, Harper, Soto, Alvarez. I think you got you've got the market on the Alvarez's. All right, we'll save your pink parallel here. Uh, give us another soda. Yeah, you can redeem these coupons, guys. I don't think there's no... They just go towards your account, so there's really no cap on them. Nope, I'm opening up pink light. Yeah, I like... I like there's no, there's really nobody on the Boston rookie wise that I'm huge on, but the other two I agree with. Poison's one of those five tool guys. Now the A's, A's are they rule five everyone, so they won't call him up because that means they got to pay his contract like two years sooner. Um, so th they do this with everyone. Um, when you're a small market team like that, I guess you have to, but Ozzy, come on, come on, come on, Rios, but I mean, how crazy deep is, um, the Dodgers to send Lux down because Lux was firmly the second best rookie, going to be the second best rookie card. I just goes to show you how deep they are. Because money's not the issue. They're not rule five in people. Yeah, let me get these sleeved up. Yeah, you definitely had a little better run last night on stuff, so. Man, I used it all up last night. 
On card auto number sixty one. I like the guys that take the uh, time to uh, put a little inky on it, put a little sp special touch. Yeah, I'm cool with just sitting around bullshitting about baseball. What's up, Scott. Let me flip this air on and burn it up. Talk a little bit louder here, guys. Uh, you should want to stick with baseball. Not a lot, just to be honest. Uh, I've already got into my... Uh, are you a fan of Goodwins, Godwins? I think we got some of that up. We've got some decent stuff out of it. Always want to get into some hockey. Yeah, we got this in the personal packs. Uh, got something I didn't put up all on the website. 2018 gallery. Well, value packs. Yeah, gallery should have. Uh, well, I know it's got Soto, Acuna. Um, and O'Shea in them. They're not on the website. Um, I don't know. I don't even know, I don't know what they're running for. What is this called? Uh, it's, it's your bigger rookies. Yeah, there's a couple autos in it. That's two own card autos a box. Uh, it's up on the website, John. I can't remember how much it is. <laughs> I'll look for you though. One sixty nine a box. I've got a box of it actually open, John. I just thought you were asking about the boxes. I don't know how many packs are in here. 
six. So there's 12 packs left. I don't actually have to. I really, I don't remember what's in there, so I'll probably be pretty friendly on it. That's why I'm trying to remember, John. I, I honestly don't remember. That's why I said I'll be pretty, pretty nice on it. I, I really, I don't, I don't even recall, to be honest. So I got them up on 12, of, they're on the website for 12, uh, let me look, get out the calculator, my head hurts too bad. Um. It'd be 144, but I, I don't know what's in here, and I don't want to tell you that there's one auto or two autos or no autos, but if you want to buy all 12, um, I'll do them for 100. So, it'd be 144 on the website, so, or we can get into the, to the box of the good ones. I can't remember if it was this box or the other. We've opened four or five boxes on these. I know he did get the a Yama, but I can't remember. Like I say, I don't want to promise anything either way. Especially when I don't remember. So. Probably long gone by now, but I'll shoot him a message, see if he remembers. But I don't know if he'll remember if it was this box or not. SP Hockey. It's up to you. I don't. Up to you guys either way. Don't matter to me. I'm hanging out for a while, so.
up to you guys. I'll hang out with bullshit and talk sports the rest of the night or open some packs, whatever you want to do. All the same to me. I'm just, I'm an ant. I'm, I'm going full, just full court press. Nice. Yeah, I like good ones. Good ones have good stuff in it. LeBron's, Michael Jordan's, Tiger Woods. Uh, there's a lot of crazy stuff in them. So we got two boxes of that. It's another it's on the website as well. Uh, Gypsy Queens got pretty pricey. Um, I think because of the rookie class, it's a pretty good looking product too. Um, a box after shipping, sleeving, probably be around two forty, two fifty for a whole box. It's going up a bunch. Uh, Egypti is two autos on card of autos per box, and the um, good ones is three hits autograph, relics, or manufactured patches. I like the good ones, god ones personally, they're just fun stuff, fun to open. <coughs> What's that? That's what I charge. Yeah, it'd be two, two forty-five on the uh, Gypsy Queen. Whatever we have this up on the website. I do have some Tops Finest though. I forgot about that. Hang on, let me get those. <clears throat> So I do uh, two mm. yeah, I'd even sell it in a mini. So I'll do two oh five for a whole box and one oh five for a mini. So it'd be two ten if you split it up into the mini and uh two oh five. You just have to Venmo me. Uh, 205 for a whole box 110 for a mini so they got two minis in them I've only got two boxes of that also so, so 205 PayPal or Venmo me it is not on the website because it's part of our break <clears throat> Yeah, up to you guys. You can pay, pal. That's fine. Oh, I guess I'd have to take the lead off. The top's finest is not on the website, guys. I just... Send uh, 205 my way or 110. That's what I said. 105 if you want a mini, which is half of the box. I, I have I actually have more of it to be here on Monday, Chad. So it's not a big deal. But as always, up to you. The customer is always right. Well, most of the time, anyways. Uh, 
Everything what are you buying here? You just buying us out, TJ? Yep. Sorry. Everything what are you buying, buying here? You just buying, buying us out, out TJ? TJ? Yep. yep. Sorry. John John's trying to become a partner. He's just gonna buy everything we got. Then we'll have to uh grandfather him in. up Mr. TJ I don't know if you're still around but yeah a lot of people have been complaining about Facebook last couple of days John and these other I mean several other groups just to kind of learn but a lot of people have been posting about Facebook messing up I've not had any issues and I know other people haven't but yeah, it's not on there, Chad. That's why I said you have to PayPal me two oh five if you want a whole box. If you just want the mini, one of the minis out of the box, PayPal me one ten. That's my PayPal. Yeah, I don't, I don't even have it on the website. Let's check out these. All right. 2018 Gallery. I only got one more pack of this left. This is a little personal for me. I was good all day and had to open none of my cards. Acuna out of the bat. Ronald Acuna Gallery rookie. Nice card. What? Soto too. If O'Shea's in there, I'm gonna retire, boys. Is that real ink? No way. Labor Torres. There's no way that's real ink, is it? Gotta be an image. Uh oh, TJ's on something. I actually already have that Soto. What do you think? I think this is just a gimmick, ain't it? That's about three of as good rookies as you can get. There's no way this is a uh, real auto H34. I'll have to look that card up. What the hell of a pack? Got one of those left, but now I feel bad for opening it. What's up, TJ? All right, somebody just sent me some money somewhere. What'd you get in on, TJ? Uh-oh, TJ's going racing. A whole box. 205, Chad. 
a mini. If you want the whole box, it's 205. If you want one of the minis, it's 110 or 105. Sorry, just PayPal me. Yes, yeah, that's, that's a hell of a pack, though. Jesus, that's a good looking card, too. Both of them's dead center. Probably 50, 60 bucks worth of cards. You racing or uh, betting your life away? Or just fanning it up, TJ? It's going well. Chad and uh, John have kept me busy tonight, so. Tell you what I'm gonna do since you guys have uh, rolled up here. Um, are either one of you a bigger fan of the other? My opinion, you're about the same players. I'm going to put this in one of y'all's bins. i put one in each bin. I think I actually have both of them. Um, I'm trying to remember if I've heard John. First to top, which one you want gets the uh, John or TJ. All right, so John's got a Kuna, and TJ's got soda, or uh, Chad's got soda. I would take soda personally, but last card's the. Oh, nice. All right, so you got, uh, Chad, you got the Soto, and uh, John, you got the Kuna. That's probably the best card y'all pulled. But both those cards are decent. I bought the uh, Soto for about 40 or 50 bucks, and those cards are clean. Those are probably 100 plus cards. Graded. So, yeah, that's crazy though. I was going to put these packs up for 10 bucks. I feel like that's got to be a bargain. Like, I'm almost enticed just to open up the other one. I don't even have them on the website. I can't remember where I found them at. That's why the 2018 stuff's so high. Up to you. Tops Finest has some good stuff in it. Uh, TJ, you got two packs, didn't you? Let me grab those real quick. Throw you in a little bonus, 17 Donruss. I think it's 17, ain't it? All right, good luck here, TJ.
Dale Earnhardt raised hell, praise Dale. Might be a Nintendo. Well, Jimmy. I don't, I know, I watch a lot of racing, but I don't know much about the short print variations. All that stuff. So if I miss one, let me know. I would love to do racing breaks. We just, we don't have enough people in it. I mean, me and maybe one or two other people are into it. This looks like a little variation here. Race Kings. Got the, I don't know what you'd call that, but the little wheel print on the side. That is a variation of some sort. I know that much. Eric. Amarola. Paul Menard. Brad. Kozlowski and Mark Martin. So they do do the Chronicles racing, and I've thought about getting a box of it, but like I said, it's we're so new that we just sat on it. Um, it's just right now we just want to keep keep the line moving. More we're ordering. A little something coming up here. Little number, Johnny Sauter, two ninety nine. Your little bonus pack. Kenny Hamlin, Al Reed, Kevin Harvick, Bowser. Yeah, whole box two hundred five. PayPal it, Chad. Yeah, TJ. Um, I may contact you on that. Um, more stuff we order, so they'll start allocating us more product. Right now we're paying just absurd amount and pricing stuff out just to keep it moving so we can get allocation money and start getting product at true MSRP pricing, which is not happening now. Um, so stuff like that, you know, we'll definitely see if we can't work something out on it. I do like racing, but like I said, it's just it's just tough for us to sit here and stare at a product for two months when we could be getting our money up. Who's that? That's Pose, right? TJ. Yep, anytime, TJ. We have to get your bat out here. It does make me kind of wonder. I don't think it is because I don't see, like, no raised. Like, if you would have signed that card, it, there would be an imprint there. That would be a pretty tough sign with the pen, pen that small. It would look like you carved it. That code card. Kyle Farmer. He's playing well. These are good-looking cards. Centered up. Yeah, I got on pretty early. I did stop for a while. We play a little poker game uh, via Poker Stars because the whole whole mass craziness is going on. So, but I have been streaming since about seven. Getting a little, getting a little tired. So, that's after I work all day.
Chad. For a box, 205. PayPal. $205. Oh. Gallery finest. Base card parallel red. Printing plate one in eight hundred and eighty two. Oh. It's not on the website if that's what you're looking for, Chad. Eh, might as well open this one too. I'm not gonna take the time to put it up on the website. Oh, got my Soto back. Man, these are good stuff. Arena. Yeah, I guess it's not. It does look like it though. Oh, Ricky. Nice. Juan Soto. Put that in my little Soto pile. Which is ironically enough right there. Yeah, I PC Soto pretty hard, so. Yeah, that's always a good card. Yeah, if you want it, Chad, send it on over. I'm gonna hop off here in a little bit. I don't. I ain't got nothing to do tomorrow. It'll be the first day in three years. It seems like. I do need to go. I keep bees also. I need to go uh, work on my bees a little bit. Check them for mites and stuff. So we have a bunch of uh, like blackberries and stuff like that around here and that's what they farm for their um, honey it makes amazing honey it's so fruity like if I get a huge amount I may actually like send some of you guys some of it in the mail little small things it's so good amazing but you do have to check them yeah I'm on I'll probably get stung about 40 times I've got uh, 16. All right, Chad's in. About, I'm, I'm talking about trying to send you free homemade honey from my house, Chad. You're over here worried about cards. That's, if you knew how many times I got stung because they're mean ass bees, or a couple of the hives are, you'd be like, hey man, that's a real nice gesture. I already gave you a Soto too, and like five solos. Yeah, yeah, a full hive will have about 50,000 in it, so 12 million sounds like a lot, but it's uh, not an absurd amount. All right, Chad Bay, here we go. Yeah, it's a... Uh, they, um, it's clover and um, a lot of blackberries. There's 
a huge amount of blackberries around us. Um, so it's, it's super fruity, man. It's, I mean, I know any beekeeper you've ever talked with, their honey's the best honey in the world. But like, we won uh, quite a bit of uh, prizes with it and stuff. So I'm going to try to uh, start. Because I have so much of it, man. And I leave so much for the bees and stuff like that just to make sure that they're good for the winters. I kind of live in the mountains. Yeah, these are good cards. We'll we'll slow burn this one. I'm getting getting close to the last call here, but all right. I think the auto is in the second pack, so we'll skip it. If it's not here. If I didn't mess this up, so there's one auto per mini on average. Evan Lux, starting out the gate. Luis Roberts, man's on fire. These are good cards. Yeah. I was worried that I think my auto's in the next pack. Well, how's that for a start? Well, we live in the um, kind of the mountains of North Carolina and live on about, I don't know, probably close to, it's basically a mountain. Um, I think the last it's it's right around 400 acres. It's nothing but fields. So, huge amount of blackberries. Looks like they shuffled the auto around. It had been in the second. All right, not the best pack, but. Tough to follow that up after the first pack there. Mm, oh, silver. Be your auto. Nope. There it is. Toro. Toro's good, man. Obviously, we wish it had been somebody different, but you definitely take a Toro autograph. Kershaw and Bellinger. Yep. Yep. We're about, I don't know. 10 minutes east of uh, Boone, North Carolina. That's probably the closest place that you may have actually heard of. Hal Schwarber, Thor, Azalea, and Judge. Judge is playing an out of his mind, man. I hate Judge too. But, man, he's about an 800 foot homer every time he bats. Uh, it's tough to not respect it. At least for a uh, financial Soto baby goat. Here's another good good one. One eleven out of one fifty. Marcio Dubin. I'm big on this guy. He's not doing a lot right now, but just think of that uh John Murphy. Think of the look at his physical. He just hadn't caught caught back up. What's that pack by? I'm sorry, what do you mean, John? Ichiro, Tops Finest, Yelich, El Baez, and Chris Brown. All right, four good cards out there. All right, last of your minis here, Chad. Top's finest. Willie Gorilla, Jose Fernandez. There we go. A little Jordan, the man. Nice. Good looking cards, though. I would sell them by the pack, but 
you always know what auto it's. What auto it is. It's always in the same pack, so we try to skip it. Soto and Keyboom. Nolan. About to get a base, Luis. You probably have a base, Luis, don't you? I think this is your uh, inky. Feels a little thicker, too, so we may have some uh, numbered ink. We got a Gavin Lux auto out of these one time. So, nice card. Jose Altuva, Jacob DeGrom, Riley Hoskins, uh, Artis Aquino. We like Artis. Artis is a big power guy. John, man, Sapphire is about $800 a box now. You, you should have took the uh, trade. It, it's absurd. Bobby Bradley in the rookie. And it just keeps going up, man. Like, I don't even... Like, we'd have to charge, like, 150 a division now. Crazy. That's why us getting our allocation money is going to be big for us. Because we can get that stuff at cost and not have to charge an obscene amount. Alright, here comes your auto. Not as quite as good as the first thing, so maybe the auto here is going to make up for it. John Means. Come on, give me a Robert. Give me a Robert. Ah, wrong white socks. Yeah, this is a good one. Yeah, your first box is definitely better. Yeah, yeah, look them up on eBay. Cover your hits here real quick. That was a tough pack to start out with. We have not seen, we've seen about every rookie ink out of them. We've opened up a bunch of them, but we have not seen a Robert Inky yet. Do like Toro though. Uh, I believe it's the old card, yep. Yeah. It is, it is. Uh, personal, we, we I still got a box of the top's finest, and I got a box of the god ones. Dad, your uh, your wife's gonna kill you. I told you I'm gonna change the receipts to uh, hair salon appointments or like fingernails. Keep you boys out of trouble. You can be like, what you spend so much on getting your hair cut? Yeah, if y'all want to split one, be generous. I'll do it a hundred a piece. 
but it will be last call, so we can get done with that. All right, well, if y'all do, send me a hundred a piece, and we'll split it. But it's last call, so as soon as we wrap that up, I'm gonna get in bed. I will be on tomorrow, but y'all may about clean me out. So. Yeah, I said I would. I'll do a hundred a piece. But like I said, it will be last call, boys. I've been up. I uh, played in the sun to about five or six today. Lost twenty bucks in poker, of course. Uh -huh. Onion recall. Has it got the Rona in it or something? How do you recall an onion? Okay, come back. Bing, bing. All right, John is paid. All right, John, I'll let you crack it open here first. We're still waiting on it. Yep, yeah, I got you, John. First pay gets the pick, so. All right, you want the front or the back one? John. You want the last one? All right. We'll go ahead and open it up here. Chance. Hiding from his wife in the bathroom. They don't get beat up. You're like, babe, it's just money. It is just money, babe. All right, good luck here, John. Third pack's always the uh, auto. I'm going to move it to the back. This is why I can't sell them by the pack, damn it. You always know where the auto's at. All right, here we go. Let's just start off with the banger. Let's just... Damn it, I thought we did. Wrong white sock. There's Jordan. Nice. Good start. Good. Ugh. Put my camera. I start there. Uh, now who do we go for? Lux. Let's just we'll build our way up. There's a queen. Uh, we'll take it. Have the man. Muncie. Yeah, Alvarez, man, you prorated his numbers out last year in the second half when he was really a rookie. MVP, hands down, wasn't even close. Got put up, ooh, got a little green stinky here. Yeah, 
Man, y'all done moved the autos on me. Jake Rogers in the green, number to 99. Look at this guy's face, man. It's wild. I, see, I don't really know a lot about him, but we'll just leave it up here. Trent Grisham playing well. I'll look that guy up. Be afraid. A little trouty. Nice. Good solid stuff so far. All right, I'll message you here in a second, Chad. I sign Diaz. He's playing well. Rico Horner and Dubin. I like Dubin. Hang on one second here. Yeah, baseball's a tough one. It's up to you, Chad. All right. I'm fine with it. Just making sure you're good. Damn it. Luis. Sorry, it's the right color. Even the gold chains was right. Another Aquino. Number to 50. T Johan Monsado. You know who I thought it was, so yeah, we'll sleep it up. Nice a little bobo. Brass Brass. Nolan. Tatis, Franklin Reyes, and Will Smith. Good solid cards. Go back through them here. Bobo, Johan, Monsada, number to 50. Aquino, Dubin, Diaz, Will Trouty Trout, Grisham, 99, Green Wave Auto, Jake Rogers, Aquino again, and a Alvarez. Yeah, Queen's got big pop. Uh. All right, Chad. I'm cool with that. You good? Confirm that's what you want to do. All right. Let me sleeve his up real quick. We'll get yours open. Howdy trout. Yeah, I got you, Chad. Just let me sleeve his up and I'll crack yours open here. I got two more to go. All right. 
Good luck. Empty, empty. All right, let's start off with some bangers here. Ichiro, Hoskin, Seth Brown. We like Seth. That's mean. There he is. Gavin Lux. Hater. The man. The Gavin Lux. Nice. Oh, Kyle Kyle. Kyle's playing. Absolutely. Ooh, a little stud pack here. A Kyle to a Lewis. Well, there's your money back. And now you gotta pay me. Get them. Travis Dimritty. Dimritty's playing well. We talked about this earlier. Rookie Otto. Wish it would have been on the Lux, but for the Robert. Labor Torres. Trevor Story, Straussburg, Francisco Goat, Soto. Let's finish with a banger here at 250. This looks Luxish. This looks real Luxish. This looks a very, very Gavin Lux pose. Like I'm almost willing to bet a quarter on this. This is the numbered 250. Gavin Lux, come on. Show me I know my cards. Uh, looking less. Looking less. That's eh, still not bad. Cody Bellinger, number 250. Nice card. Literally him and Lux bat is at the exact same angle. Gavin Lux, num or, uh, Cody Bellinger, number 250, Purple Wave. Bellinger is playing at an MVP level, so it's a, it's a nice card. It's just, we would have preferred it to been a Lux. Good cards. Good cards. I think, I don't know, man. The more I watch Lewis play, the more I'm not sure he's not the best player between him and Robert. Everybody's really high on it. It's fair. But, and Robert looks the part. I mean, hang on, let me sleeve it up. Now nah, I'm out on the uh, tops. That was my last, last box on that stuff, man. I can get more, but it would probably be Monday where I would be able to get it here. So, this is my theory as to why. Which one looks like a professional ball player? Clearly, it's this guy. I mean, he's 6'4", 6'5", built like an outside linebacker. This guy is just elbows and bones and looks like he snuck in the back door. But go watch him play. You'll see what I'm talking about. Next time you catch a Seattle game on, watch this guy. He, he He's really good. He's getting bigger, too. You can tell he's getting stronger. But it's not, you know, there's not a lot of guys can hit a baseball consistently 500 foot. But give me the guy that can hit a ball squarely five out of ten times. Yeah. But...
But Lewis, man, Lewis can play. Runs, fields, does everything correctly. I don't know. Only thing, only reason I'm not the biggest Judge fan is he strikes out too damn much for me. This is why, I, like when I watch, like you know, these people in the minor leagues, I'm looking for the guys who just don't strike out, who always make good, solid contact. Because physically, their power come as they get bigger and stronger. So these are the cards I try to collect and invest in. Like I can't tell you if I sold all my Sotos, Sotos. I can't tell you how much money I would have made off of off of that because when I literally when I would watch him when he was 16 17 uh, cuz I subscribed to the MI MILB with no minor leagues this year um, I mean the guy just went strike and he rope everything he just didn't have the power to get it out of the ballpark Yeah judge judge hits balls 500 feet like most people hit singles but he strikes out too damn much. Like it, it's tough to win a championship when your best player strikes out every other at bat. <clears throat> Cause come October, ball don't just it don't fly quite as far, and uh, pitching is a little bit better. So I mean, it's just you don't see a lot of big power guys have huge postseasons. I mean. Trying to think the last one that was a true power guy that just had a monster postseason. You know, it's just. It don't happen a lot. So. But no, I like Judge. It's just, I'm not a fan of the strikeouts. Yeah, that stuff matters, dude. These guys that can square it up consistently, those are the great players. And Manny was another one. Look at Manny's, uh, you know, pictures of him coming out of the minor, all elbows and bones. And, but same thing. Like, he squared everything up. Just, you know, you couldn't strike him out. Hit everything solidly. So, there's a lot more of those guys that make it than there's a lot more of these huge power guys that strike out, you know, six out of ten times and bat 260 and occasionally hit a 470-foot homer. Yeah. All right, boys. Been fun chatting sports, bullshitting. Um, but I am going to hop off here. I do appreciate it. Um, I'm working on trying to get our, our better customers' um, shirts. Um, but my sister is the one who does the printing, and our mom got put in the hospital for about a week. And she spent a lot of time with her and wasn't able to print them. I was supposedly supposed to have them about two weeks ago. So. so, but I promise as soon as I do get them in, I will send our better customers, our best customers shirts. So. I am going to work on the honey because the honey's amazing. 
it's amazing. A little teaspoon in your coffee or a little bit in your uh, JD, John, if you've known him long as I have. But uh, I do appreciate it, especially John and uh, Chad tonight. But uh, everybody have a good night. I will be... I'll be on tomorrow, worst case scenario. So, don't know exactly how long tomorrow, but I really don't have much going on on um, Sundays. So, a little knob. I do like a little, little uh, bourbon and some, a little splash of honey. Takes that, uh, knocks the edge off a little bit. You have a good night, John. Good night, Chad.